All right, guys, I'm here. Welcome, Coaster Spotters, to my first ever visit to Disneyland Paris. I'm gonna start out with the studio park since it closes in about three hours. So I have about six hours tonight to enjoy the two parks. Hopefully get on all the coasters and I have just enough to hit 900 tonight. So let's go. Have now entered Walt Disney Studios. Got my annual pass taken care of. Took a little bit longer than I would have liked because there was like uh, two families of like, I don't know, eight in front of me. So that was unfortunate. And they only had two booths open this late. Uh, the park is closing in about two hours and 20 minutes. So I'd heard about this entry plaza. I'll see it for myself. I don't hate it. I don't really like it though either. So the goal day is to ride all the coasters. Uh, I'm gonna take in the park a lot more, uh, do shows, take in the details, do other non-coaster rides on Friday after I've returned from the south of France. Do a bunch of parks down there. And uh, here we go, there's the tower right there. Well, I didn't realize how close it is. And that's like the back of the park. So when people said this park was small, they weren't joking. There we go though, tower of terror. We're gonna go ahead to Rock and Roller Coaster cause that is uh, number one on my hit list. Just for the fact that by the end of this trip, that coaster will be closed for a lengthy re-theme to something Marvel, I believe. I cannot remember what exactly it's supposed to be. By the end of the trip, I'll uh, study up on everything that's going on with this park. I, I, you know, I know that a lot is coming to this park. It's gonna change a lot. I'm kind of excited to see this one pre-changes though. I never got to see California Adventure beforehand. Wow, oh my God, that's the back of the park. This park is so small, oh my God. Seriously. All right, 10 minute wait. I have done Rock and Roller Coaster in Florida like twice and it was, uh, oh dear God, it was uh, 18 years ago. So uh, I might as well have not written it. Very excited to give this a go. Alright, so just got off my first ride on Rock and Roller Coaster starring Aerosmith. Uh, yeah, so we pulled up to the launch, it started doing its countdown, music started playing, and we didn't launch. Uh, I thought we e stopped. Turned out someone had their cell phone out, and I couldn't believe how the staff treated that guest. She was like, I see it between your legs, I'm not stupid. And then she like blamed her for everyone not having music. Uh, as far as the ride goes, so, so that was interesting. But as far as the ride goes, really fun. I really liked it. I, I can't compare it to the one at Walt Disney World. It's been way too long to even begin to compare that. So, uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. Uh, I definitely need to ride it again when there's music. i uh, probably do that on Friday a couple times. And, uh, yeah. So let's move on to Tower, see if there's any fast passes there. I doubt it. But uh, then do the RC Racer and Crushes, and we'll see. Maybe I'll have time for Ratatouille. All right, so definitely hit is the tram tour for me. This, I believe, it's not closing yet, but it, it's definitely on the chopping block. I don't think they have announced it, but we're pretty sure it's closing. So that is definitely gonna be something I wanna do, especially since Walt Disney World is done with. And uh, these look like food and wine booths. Ooh, look at all those beers. Ooh, hello. Ooh. Love this queue line for RC Racer. Next coaster I'm gonna do here. 
Uh, I am not really excited for this. This looks so dumb. I mean, it just looks like a half pipe without the spinning. Uh, or Superman without the speed. Uh, the cars, it looks awesome, the RC car, because, like, RC was awesome when I was little. I, I freaking loved RC. He was, like, one of my favorite characters in Toy Story. Uh, this line's cute. It is so small, though, but I don't have any reference because I haven't been to one in Disney World, but, uh, it's really cute what's here, that's for sure. So this was pretty much one of the coasters I was looking forward to least on the trip. And, and, and it was pretty disappointing. It, it's just not much to it. It's not that fast. A little bit of air time. Um, it's okay. It's not as bad as I thought it would be. So I guess that's good. So we're gonna move on, get on crushes, and, and then move on over to the good park. Actually, the better park. This park's not bad. It's just small, and it needs, like, a lot added to it. Ratatouille is five minutes in the single rider line? Yeah, I'll do Ratatouille. All right, so unpopular opinion. Uh, that ride is not that good. That is very overrated, and uh, I'm glad I only waited about five minutes. Uh, I, I feel like I might want to do it again because of... Yeah, maybe I missed something in the queue line that really sets it apart, but the ride itself? Uh, moving on to Crush's Coaster. So, another thing I'm not really that excited for. Actually, a little bit. Uh, Alright, here we go. Crush's Coaster, 40 minute wait. Single ride seemed to be done for the day. Just took a ride on Crush's Coaster for the very first time. Uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. Uh, the uh, parts before the lift go. Uh, the dark ride portions, this custom portion, is really good. Uh, I really like the theming, the, the dark ride section. But once you go up that main lift hill, once you drop off that lift hill, it's just a big open building with not a lot of effects. Very, very disappointing. So, uh, thumbs in the middle, I think. So, yeah. I might give it another try. Probably will give it another try. Um, unfortunately, the single rider line was closed when I got in line, but then it eventually opened up and there was like no line. So, that was very annoying. Uh, I probably wasted a lot of time because of that. So, but I'm very happy to finally head over to the other park. So, first impressions of the park. Obviously, I just did the coasters and Ratatouille. So, uh, I don't have the full experience, and I do want to give it a little bit more time before I give my final opinion on it. But I don't hate it. It is very small, though. There's just not much to do. Um, I don't know. I haven't been to Hollywood Studios in Florida for a very long time, so I might feel the same way about that place, too, to be honest with you. Uh, but they're, 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 I know they're nothing like each other. That's probably a pretty bad comparison. But, uh, yeah, it's okay. I'm really excited to do the tram tour later. I wish I was able to do the Armageddon. I know it was terrible, but I think I would have loved it for how bad it was. Uh, unfortunately, that is now closed, so can't do that. Uh, I, I need to get a better ride, and that kid has the same dance of pants. Okay. But, uh, I need to get a better opinion of that with the full soundtrack, so, which I will do. But, uh, there we go. Alright, let's go into the main park. Oh man, this is amazing. If that hotel wasn't so expensive to go to, I would so spend the money because, oh, that would be amazing. I really like this entrance. This entrance is fantastic. It's uh, such a more class, it's just such a more like detailed entrance than the American versions, but it still looks familiar, but so much better. Yeah, this is so much nicer. 
than either American parks. And here's the reveal. Okay, guys, let's go. It's like America, but so much nicer. I love it. Wow. So I have a good idea of where I'm going, but not totally. So just going to explore. All right, let's enter into Frontierland. Very excited about this for Phantom Matter and uh, Big Thunder. Big Thunder has been a bucket list forever. Ooh, waffles. I think I might have to get some of those waffles. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh, this is so cool. Big Thunder has a 70 minute wait, Phantom Manor, 10 minute wait. So I think we're gonna come back to Big Thunder. Hopefully that line dies down a little bit. So let's go on a ride on Phantom Manor. Very excited about this. 13 minute wait, that means no wait. Oh yeah. Even you. This chamber has no windows and no doors, which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out. <laughs> a plaisir de vous aider. So, I enjoyed that. Somehow, I thought that was like vastly different than the American parks uh, and it's really not there's more detail uh, it, it, overall it is better but it's not like blow me away comparison in difference like levels so a little disappointed there definitely enjoyed it uh, let's move on Next up, Indiana Jones, the Temple du... Five minutes, not surprised. Didn't hate it, it wasn't very smooth, but it wasn't uh, a killer. I, I liked it, it was fine. Uh, nothing to really go crazy about, but uh, it was fun. And now this is awesome. Oh, and I'll watch this one. Yay, light. Oh, man. Yeah, I can't wait to explore all this stuff on Friday. Oh, my God. It's going to be amazing. All right. Heading to Casey Jr. And uh, then we'll see from there. Oh, this park is amazing. Okay, I think this is Pirates. Yeah, that's Pirates. I am so lost. Hey, look, they have a Peter Pan with a long line. Some things never change. So, holy crap, no. I'll have to do that with early entry. So, now I've noticed that a lot of, like, all the restaurants are closed by 9 o'clock. And a lot of the other stands are closed by by nine o'clock. This is ridiculous. Like, I want to get something to eat and like everything's closed. Now, there's just so much stuff I want to explore, but today is not the night. All right, so I didn't realize that that section of the park closed at nine. So, uh, no Casey for me. So I'm gonna ride it small.
I think that is going to do it for the vlog tonight. Uh, yeah, let's just call it from the night. I am tired. I think I am just going to go ride Big Thunder Mountain and uh, skip out. I think Space Mountain's been down for a little while and I don't know if it's going to reopen. So, uh, yeah, that's that's it from day one uh, in, of the Euro trip. Uh, so far, it's been great. Disney is amazing, as usual. Uh, but I am so tired and I can't wait to experience it when uh, I have a lot more sleep in me. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And comment below. See you tomorrow for day two.